Welcome by Smart Family. Today, we're diving into a face-off between two robotic vacuum titans. On the left, we have the Tycom Robot Vacuum, and on the right, it's the Rop Vacnik Robot Vacuum Cleaner. Will Tcom suck? In a good way? Or will Rop Vacnik sweep away the competition? Let's find out. First up, let's talk about the one thing that's on everyone's mind. Price. Tcom comes in at a wallet squeezing $399. Meanwhile, Rop Vaknik offers itself for just $299. That's a whole hundred bucks less! Reviewers appreciate the affordable price of the Rop Vaknik, making it a cost-effective option for keeping floors clean in between deep cleanings. So if you're on a budget, Rop Vaknik is the way to go. Next, let's get to the sucky part. Suction power. Tecum boasts a respectable 3,000 pascals, which is great for everyday cleaning. However, Rob Vaknik ups the ante with 4,000 pascals, providing stronger suction power that tackles dirt and pet hair effortlessly. Reviewers have praised Rob Vaknik for its powerful suction, making it a valuable addition to any home. Tycom, you tried, but Rob Vaknik just sucked better this time. Now, let's see how these bad boys navigate. Tikom's got 360 degrees LIDAR navigation, allowing it to create detailed maps for up to five floors. Reviewers love the intelligent navigation and mapping capabilities, making it a convenient and versatile cleaning device. Rob Vaknik uses advanced sensors and algorithms to navigate, and, while it's praised for being efficient and avoiding obstacles, Tycom's LIDAR is just too cool to ignore. Point for Tycom! Both Tycom and Rob Vaknik come with two-in-one mopping and vacuuming capabilities. Tycom offers sweeping, mopping, or both at once with three-level water output. Rob Vaknik's got a high-capacity water tank and a four-stage water adjustment system. Reviewers appreciate the versatility of both products, but Tycom's simplicity and effectiveness win the day. Unless you're mopping the Pacific Ocean, you probably don't need four stages of water adjustment. Another point for Tycom. When it comes to battery life, Tycom claims a solid 150 minutes in quiet mode and it even resumes cleaning where it left off after recharging. Reviewers have highlighted Tycom's impressive battery life and efficiency. Rop Vaknik, though, doesn't specify its runtime but has advanced self-recharge capabilities. While both have their strengths, Tycom's reliability and longer runtime take the cake here. Both vacuums offer app and voice control. Tycom uses the Tuya Smart app and works with Alexa and Google Home. Reviewers appreciate the ease of use and the ability to set no-go zones, virtual walls, and no-mop zones with Tycom. Rob Vaknik also syncs with Alexa and Google Assistant, making both of them pretty convenient. However, Tycom's additional features make it feel like having a tiny, obedient butler. Tycom for the win! Overall, both the Tcom and Rob Vaknik robot vacuums have received positive reviews from users. Tcom is praised for its intelligent navigation, strong suction, and dual functionality, making it a highly recommended cleaning solution. Rob Vaknik, on the other hand, is lauded for its powerful suction, ease of use, and affordability, making it a valuable addition to any home. So, in this epic showdown, Tycom takes the crown with more features and better functionality. But hey, if you're on a budget, Rob Vaknik is still a solid contender. Either way, your floors will be cleaner than your internet history. Thanks for watching by SmartFam. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave a comment about which product you prefer and why. Product links are in the description. Until next time, keep buying smart.